What's good, YouTube? This your boy Chi World back at y'all again with another art tutorial. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, go ahead and do that now. Make sure you click post notifications so you will be notified every time I drop some heat. And without further ado, let's jump right into this video. So we're gonna start out with making our blueprint. So let me see. Let me set my pen. game now we in the game let's go what i like to do i like to try to shape out what i'm drawing So we're gonna highlight everything. We're gonna drop the opacity down. We're gonna still stay. Bring your opacity back up. Now we finna try to make our line work a little more sharper. Now we finna add another layer. <clears throat> it's time to do our black line work. So this is where we go in with the detail. Thank you. 
Finish with the line work. Now, all we gotta do now is group every line, make every line one. So we're gonna merge it together. All you do is click your pointer tool, I mean, your selection tool, highlight everything, go to object, expand appearance, and then go to your pathfinder and click merge. And after you click that, Every line that you made just became one. Now we're gonna come to our layers and we're gonna drag the line work layer to the blank sheet of paper to make a copy of it. And we're gonna lock the top layer. Click, make sure you got your, hot, your second layer selected. Come over here, your rectangle tool. Let's see, I'm gonna start out with the color. Let's see, gray. All we're gonna do is drag our rectangle tool over our line work. Click selection tool. Make sure you got your rectangle selected. And then we're gonna right click the rectangle. And we're gonna go to arrange and send the rectangle to the back. Now the, the rectangle is behind our line work. So we're gonna click off of it, highlight everything. And what it's gonna do when you highlight everything, it's gonna grab that rectangle and it's gonna grab the line work as well. And while we got them both selected now, we're gonna click merge. And after you click merge, you can click off of it. Now you can click right back on it. And go to isolate selected group. Click that. So every, every group is gonna click it separate. So we're gonna I'm gonna delete. I'm gonna delete that. Now we can click certain areas and change it to a certain color. What we finna do now, we finna add another layer just for our shades, our shadows. So, add another layer and put it between the line work and the color layer. Now we finna work on doing our shadows.
All right, now what you wanna do, you wanna unlock everything. Just say, nah, just keep your keep your line work at the top locked though, but other than that, unlock your color and your shade and your, your layer with the shading on it. And you're gonna highlight it. So just, just say, if I wanted to, I like the way it look, but I wanna like make it darker. I wanna change the color up a little bit. I wanna change the color up just a tad. So we're gonna go to, uh, we're gonna edit, edit colors, then we're gonna go to recolor with presets. Click this, go to auto right here, and click all, and then you can adjust colors. I wanna make that more red. I'm gonna make this one darker. 